So I just came across something in the wild that uh, was pretty important to make a video on. This was included in a kit uh, for a security lab, uh, which you get to do things to this device. But you can see here that it is a Chinese wall adapter. So it has, or a smart plug. So it has, if you open up here, it has the Chinese pins. So they included with this a travel adapter. And the idea behind this is that you plug this travel adapter into there, and you can now plug this into a US outlet. But they included this, um, I think maybe not realizing how dangerous these are for a multitude of reasons. And there's other videos of this on YouTube, but this is the first time I've come across one in the wild in a kit, uh, not related to electrical safety. So these right here, if not used properly, are extremely dangerous. Like electrocution, burn your house down kind of dangerous. What these can be used for safely is something like this. This is just like a, a iPad charger. Um, the pins are not polarized, so they can go in either way. There's no ground pin. So if you plug this into there and plug this into the wall, that'll be fine. It'll work without any problem. There's no electrical difference in here. But where this starts getting dangerous, really dangerous, is when you get to three-prong devices. So you can see that there's the uh, live neutral and the ground pin here. So you can plug in a three-pin device and it plugs in just fine. But there's no earth pin on this side, like that. So if you feel effectively, you've defeated ground by plugging it into this. You can also plug it in upside down, reverse the polarity of the current that's going through it, if it's not designed for it. Uh, you can also just sort of put one of the pins in here and just sort of, you know, do one of these and just sort of make brief contacts. Or the worst of all, you can put the ground pin or the earth pin directly into the live socket and electrify the device on the other end. So while people wouldn't normally do this, unless maybe they're like fumbling around in the dark and, you know, just not really paying attention, um, children are one of the main concerns with this um, because kids like to mess with stuff. And, you know, this device lets you very easily defeat all of the regulations, electrical regulations and safety standards there are, essentially. Um, so a kid can easily electrify them, or electrify a device or electrocute themselves. And worse off, if the kid's young enough and likes keys, keys will fit very easily into here with no trouble. And this key would be putting out lethal amounts of power if this was plugged in. And even with the included uh, smart switch or smart plug here, this is not safe to use with this. In <laughs> fact, um, because if you plug it in like this, like you would normally, you can see there's an earth pin here, and there's no earth pin on this side. Fortunately, with this particular adapter, um, for a US plug, you cannot plug a earth plug into here. There's just no way to do it. But that being said, if you're using a plug from a different country that uses this metal settler earth pin, um, there's no earth pin on this side. So there's nothing that's actually going to be sending, allowing current to flow. And again, this also lets you do cool things like take the Chinese ground and plug it into the US hot with no, uh, nothing stopping it. So, Main takeaway, again, don't use these um, unless you have a very good reason to. And the only thing you should be using them with are these non-polarized charge packs here. Everything else, don't do it.